about to get underway. D. Williams. He is out to the 23 yard line and here comes that Tennessee offense. Well when you look at what they're doing now when they're getting the ball out on the perimeter where they see one on one coverage and it's just speed and space so these are extended handoffs. All day to throw wide open. Ramel Keaton touchdown Tennessee and for the ninth time this year the ball score on their opening drive 56 yards. Ramel Keaton. Handoff. That one goes to freshman Cedric Alexander, a big hitter right up the middle over the 40, out to the 44 yard line. So a big gain of 17 on their first play from scrimmage. Tennessee's back in the secondary. There's McGowan again. They hand it off to him. Around the right side, breaks a couple of tackles. He's got another Vanderbilt first down. A flag comes out. Two tight ends. Two receivers, one running back. And off to the right side, Alexander again. Actually, they go, oh my goodness, what a fake. They go to Cheryl. Everybody on the field, including me, bit the fake. And Tennessee can't catch Cheryl. Where's this offense been all year for Vanderbilt? Junior Cheryl, touchdown, Commodores. Big hole off the right side. Here's Small. Cuts it back to the middle with a stiff arm and dragged down at the 10 yard line. A touchdown saving tackle by Bryce Cowan. Second down and goal. Milton to the corner of the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Tennessee. McCowan Castles with his fourth touchdown reception of the year. See Castles here on the rub, and he gets to Ricky Wright in one-on-one -on -one coverage. Great throw, great catch, way to get big. They just needed a spark offensively. This offense really has struggled the last month, month and a half. And A.J. gave them their best chance to move the football. Nice little touch pass. That one goes to Quincy Skinner. He is out over the 45 to the 47, maybe 48-yard line. Again, a 22 on the play. Right now, what we're seeing from Vanderbilt is the idea of using condensed sets. They get it out to Skinner on the perimeter. But with those condensed sets, they bunch you to two. Five-man front. They go 5-0. Four-man rush. Swan underhand to Cedric Alexander, and he'll be stopped at the 47 by Aaron Beasley. Joe Milton, pass caught over the middle. Jacob Warren will get it into Vandy territory. Joe Milton off, off the pop pass. Warren just releasing off the run action. Splitting defenders down the middle of the field. Joe Milton's pass is complete and then dropped. I think Vandy will have it. Yes, they will. The Commodores come up with a turnover. After further review, runner completed the catch and his knee was down at the 38 and a half yard line prior to losing possession. That's over the Tennessee ball there. Second down. There's Warren. The tight end goes in motion. Milton dodges one man and goes toward the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Jacob Warren. 34 yards. You watch Nate Clifton on the pressure here, but Joe Milton sidesteps and is able to find his target. Swan. That pass is caught by Will Shepard. He's out over the 40 to the 42 yard line. Brought down there. One of four on third downs. This time, nowhere to run. Patrick Smith slammed to the turf. We're going to say the runner was down. James Pierce, though. Kick is on the way, and it is dead solid. Perfect. A little over five minutes off the clock for that 40 yard field goal to make it 21 to 10. Here is D. Williams. 
Indeed, to the 30, to the 35, and drop there. Let's go downstairs to Taylor Davis. You look at his ability to go 0 to 60. He can cover a lot of grass. He's physical. Here's Jalen Wright. Jalen inside the 40, down to the 39 of Vanderbilt. Quick first step, the ability to get to the second level. Joe Milton steps up, fires near side, and they're going to say a catch. <laughs> Castle. What a job by McCallan Castle. Quick snap. Right, trying to break a tackle, does so. Still on his feet down to the five yard line, and it takes a swarm of white jerseys to bring him down. To attempt a 24 yarder. Good clean snap. And the kick is up, and it is good. They've all had a little taste of running the show this year. Lofts it up. Nice throw. Speaking of great throws, Shepard makes the catch, stays on his feet inside the 40, down to the 36 yard line. Boy, Clark League talks about throwing a catchable ball. Throws the prettiest ball. He puts this thing up. It's up in the air before Will Shepard even gets his eyes back. It gets up, it gets down. He'll play fake. A.J. Swan pocket collapses, and he will be dropped at the 40-yard line. They're just going to run it, and that'll be Cedric Alexander hit by Pierce. And here we go. Punches are being thrown. It is a mess. Flags, helmets come flying off. This is a – this is bad. Here come the teams. Oh, boy. Clock approaching one minute to go before halftime. He's coming near side with it. Here's Jalen Wright. He'll have a first down inside the 30, down to the 27 yard line, a gain of 15. A couple of tight ends. Joe Milton going to try to run for it, and he will. Touchdown, Tennessee. Joe Milton here with the run pass option. <laughs> he faked it to Warren. First down and 10. Joe Milton will hand it off, coming near side. There is Jalen Wright with a nice carry to start things off. Now, in third down, four down, bring him five. Boy, nice throw by Milton. Pass is caught. Here's an opportunity. Ramel Keaton. Zone. Touchdown, Volunteers. 46 yards, his second of the day. You know, here, they bring six-man pressure, and it's just a nice job by Keaton of spinning out and turning on the Jets to get to the end zone. Nowhere to run. Patrick Smith swallowed up. Here's McGowan, a little bit of a reverse. McGowan nowhere to go. He will lose four or five yards. Actually get lose him. Lose six yards on the play. No zone. Swan wrestled to the turf. Brought down by Tyler Barron. His sixth sack of the year. Tennessee up 28. A little quick screen on the perimeter. Quick screen turns into a big gain as they hit Squirrel White. We'll play action here. Another nice throw. Complete inside the 30. That one goes to White again. Squirrel White starting down. Balls line up quickly. Milton again. Another touchdown for Joe Milton, his second rushing touchdown of the day. He's now accounted for six touchdowns. Joe Milton here just sees the end crash down. 
and the defender standing flat footed on the perimeter. So he just outruns Jalen Mahoney <laughs> to the goal line. Line drive kick. That one is bobbled. Loose ball on the turf. Patterson comes up with it inside the 10 yard line. A couple of feet for Pater for the Commodores. Seals on a keeper. And he will get into the end zone. Touchdown, Vanderbilt. He had a little touch push there. For Ken Seals, that's going in a few minutes. You can catch that one on ESPN. Here's Patrick Smith off the right side. First down, not over the 45 to the 46 yard line. Have a vertical threat. Over the middle pass caught. That goes to the tight end, Justin Ball, who is inside the 30 down to the 27 yard line. Talked about, I mean, these tight ends getting big. But he's 6'7, so to be a 6'7 hurdler, that's a pretty nifty move for a big fella. That's pretty solid. Yeah. McGowan goes in motion. Oh, nice spin move by Smith, but spun right into the edge rush. What a, a rivalry that is. Touchdown. Skinner makes the catch. Of the season. What an adjustment. I mean, you're watching almost do a 180. Reach back around to make the catch. That one's caught by Caleb Webb. He'll have the first down inside the 40 down to the 39 yard line. Pass caught by Salmon. Out of bounds, just outside the 10 yard line. But the 117th meeting between these two teams will go to the Tennessee Volunteers as they went at 48 to 24.